Hey everyone, I have a really simple little trick here today to show you how to use dotting tools to make a lace border. So because I'm doing this with Valentine's Day approaching, I'm going to use a heart as my example. I'm lining it out with a white chalk pencil because the rock is already primed with black paint. I'm going to paint my heart red. This will take several coats to make sure we've got good coverage. And then I'm gonna add some red glitter paint to make it sparkle. Now I'm going to take a fine line brush and add a white border around the heart. If you were going to do this with the same color, you could use red to add the lace border, then you would just go straight to the dotting part and skip this border. But for a little extra dimension, I wanted to add a white lace border on this heart. Now you can use whatever dotting tool you like. I have nail dotting tools, I have my mandala dotting tools. I decided to go ahead and go with the number nine of my mandala dotting tool set for the initial dots. And so you're just gonna take white paint and add the dots around the border of this. So you're gonna kind of get that dotting tool on the edge of your white border. It's gonna be a little blotchy, but that's okay because we're gonna come back and smooth out the um, initial line that we did around the heart. You'll also notice a couple of spots here where the black is kind of showing through because the dot didn't fully cover. And that's okay also because we're gonna cover that up when we come back with the fine line brush. So now I'm gonna take that fine line brush and just kind of smooth out any blotchiness in the dots as well as just kind of draw that outline all over again to kind of meld the dots in with the outline on the rock. Now's where the magic happens. I'm gonna switch gears and use this nail dotting tool and we're gonna use the base coat color of the rock to add smaller dots on the white dots. So we're gonna add some black dots right in the center of those white dots that we created. So it may not look like they're in the center because there's a little bit more of the white color to the left of the dot, but it's actually in the center of the white dots. And you're just gonna continue this all around the entire border of the rock and you're going to see the lace begin to form. I love this technique because it creates very uniform looking lace. You could take a very fine line Posca pen or a paint pen to kind of draw those loops, but I can never get them to come out as uniform as this. So I just love this technique for creating a very uniform lace border. I think this is also a case where less is more. I'm not gonna write anything on this rock. It's perfect just as it is. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss future uploads. See you next time.